Hey, everybody. Ash, how are you? Hello. Hall H. <laughs> wow. Wow. Please join us in welcoming the creators and cast of She-Hulk, writer Jessica Gao, director Anuvalia, director Kat Koiro, Jamila Jamil, Ginger Gonzaga, and Tatiana Maslany. Oh. Hall H is the thing that everybody talks about when they come to Comic-Con or they hear about Comic-Con. They're like, have you been to Hall H? Um, and I, and I, can't believe that we got to show them a trailer that we hadn't seen yet. Just sit and watch it with them. Um, it's just such a joy. You know, Marvel fans are, are voracious and they know everything about every movie and every, you know, side character, so it's pretty cool. I think that they'll find it's very relatable, it's very human, and it's also super funny in a way that uh, I don't know that, you know, we've seen, we've definitely seen comedic. Uh, explorations of movies in the Marvel Universe, but this one is like a legal comedy, half-hour sitcom, so it's it's a totally different thing. And I was nervous to step into it, but when I read the, the pilot script that Jessica Gao wrote, um, it was just so funny and so weird and really unexpected, and I was like, if this weren't a Marvel thing, I would still want to audition for this, so um, yeah, it's pretty cool. I love Comic-Con and I've always wondered what it's like in Hall H. I've never been able to even get in there before because you have to camp for days. And so to be able to meet everyone, see everyone, feel the energy in the room of even when they're not screaming, you can feel their support and enthusiasm. They're the best fans in the world and I'm so over the moon to be a part of this universe now. We showed a brand new trailer, never seen before, and it shows so much more of the show and the tone of the show, and it kind of answers more questions as to where we're going, and shows how irreverent and fresh this is. There's nothing like it quite, quite, there's nothing quite like it in the Marvel Universe. We had Kevin Feige standing on the stage with us, which is so ridiculous, and, and I nerd out so hard for him because of what he's done for Cinematic Universe, and opportunities he's given for people who look like me, and for different marginalized groups, I think it's very cool, but also uh, the beautiful and excellent Tatiana Maslany and Ginger Gonzaga, like, I just, I couldn't be luckier to stand next to those people and to work with them for six months. None of us had seen this new trailer, so it was really fun. Tatiana and I were just sitting on the ground, kind of like kids, like watching it along with everyone else, kind of screaming and geeking out over like our, our material, which sounds narcissistic. But it was new to us, and it was very exciting. <laughs> What I love about all the Marvel um, comics is how it's always uh, it's always saying something and and showing something that people can relate to. So I want people to be able to relate to She-Hulk and someone who who's kind of forced to come into their power and live in a body that's different or and take up a lot of space as a woman and have a lot of power and own being special. So I really like that part of it because I think everyone can relate to that and I hope that they do and gain that type of confidence the same way Jennifer Walters eventually has to. I can't tell you how cathartic it is to finally just see it out and for people to actually receive it. It's really great. It's so nice to really see this physical reminder of what you're who you're making this for and how excited and happy they are. And it makes the hard work make sense, you know? Being in Hall H was overwhelming and I was so nervous and then as soon as I stepped out onto the stage and started talking about the project that I feel so genuinely passionate about, it became fun. And hearing the crowd reaction was just such a thrill and watching the trailer, which, you know, I've seen every moment of that trailer for years and it was still exciting, like I was seeing it for the first time with the fans. There was She-Hulk herself, Miss Tatiana Maslany. We had Ginger Gonzaga, who plays her best friend, Nikki Ramos. We had Jamila Jamil, who plays Titania. And then my fellow director, Anu Valia, and the writer, Jessica Gao. It really feels, especially with Marvel, like you make it for the fans. So to see them gathered in one place after three years of not being able to come and celebrate was really, really exciting. You make these shows, you you hope you're servicing people, you hope you're servicing the fans, and then to actually get to show our work to a group of people who are so excited, like, you can feel it. You can feel that energy and it's so much love and I just really hope they like the show because making it was so much fun and then to just feel that energy, I'm like, I can't wait till you see it. 
It's Tatiana, who plays She-Hulk, Jennifer Walters, and we have Ginger Gonzaga, who plays Nikki, and Jamila Jamil, who plays Titania, and Kat Coyro, who directed the first three and the last three episodes. And Jessica Gower, beautiful creator and head writer.